In this tutorial, we'll look at how you can use add as a sliced loop player. This function is very useful when importing files from applications such as Recycle or Beat Creator, applications that export a file as sliced WAVs plus a MIDI file. I'll import a file that has been divided into 14 slices along with its related MIDI file. Entering the browser page, find and load our WAV slices. Select all and import. Entering the keymap page, we can see the slices already positioned on their root node, which was set when they were exported. Now I'll save the key group. Now let's go to the RPS environment. In the global page, I'll straight away turn off the key track and through in order to use the slice loop player. Now enter the editor page. By clicking on the triangle next to the clip section, I choose Import MIDI. And in the same folder as the slices, select and import the related MIDI file. Now we can see and hear it on clip A1. Now let's do some editing and change the quantize time and length. Then add a bit of punch to certain bass drum notes using the velocity. Now I'll set the pattern so it just plays on the note C3. Then I can copy and paste it onto another clip, A2. And modify its note range so it just plays on C-sharp 3. Copy it one more time, and this time set it onto D3. Now we have three identical rhythms on three notes. So I can start to make some variations. Let's first vary the copy on A2. Now I'll change the third pattern. Altering various notes and velocities. Now we've got three variants of the same pattern triggered by three different notes. Now let's finish by changing some of the parameters in the global page. These will affect all the clips in the clip set. First I'll add a bit of swing quantize. Then I'll change the velocity and length of all the notes affected by the swing. And finally, the sensitivity to velocity, which is effective for making breaks. Now I'll bring up a bass patch to hear what it sounds like with it. And also a tone patch, Whipper, so we can keep on building. and so on to keep on building.